Hey guys, hope all is well. Today I decided to film a video for you guys. It's just gonna be a quick flip through of my CP Petite. Thank you so much for watching my last video, which was my personal planner. It was a bit long, but thanks for sticking through it and watching and commenting. It really helped me to know what kind of videos you like. And if you hear any shaking in the back, that's my little puppy Pluto. He's going out of sock right now. All right, so let's get started. So in the front pocket here, I don't have much. I slimmed it down the other day. I just felt like it was like too much. So I have um, the Lux Plage flag and I just have a um, memo and then I took out the other memo and put the note in. I have um, some page flags. I've been loving this color like Apollo Mykonos. I'm really loving that color. I just have a little Dior card where they gave me a sample of a perfume and I absolutely love Dior. So I just put that in my pocket as a reminder. And then this just goes perfectly with this because you deserve luxury, why not? And then I have a little Polaroid of me and the hubby. Inside here, I have one of those cloth and paper um, to keep folders that our receipts come in. And I just have a few planner cards in here, nothing too crazy. Right, so, okay, so my C Petite, my CP Petite is really just for like scratch notes, maybe some daily um, personal reflection kind of thing. So really it's just for scrap notes, but I love all these little decorative dashboards that talks about luxury and all that. I'm with it. Here's another dashboard. I believe all these dashboards came from the sub boxes that we received. And then this one on the back, it's like an embroidered one that says don't settle or embossed, I mean. I have the weekly admin in here. I just kind of sketch out my week based off of what's happening in the personal or in my A5 planner. So really, it's just like an overview of the week and what's happening. I really do love how I've been setting that up. And then you just go into some notes. Here's my to-do list and some 2024 um, that I wrote out for what I wanted for some inserts. And then I have some sticky notes from cloth and paper. I really love this color. It comes with the black, so I have a goals page here. And really, it's just notes, like all note pages. And until you get to back here, also notes, meeting notes. Here's another gorgeous dashboard from Cloth and Paper. This is the Fika, you can see my reflection, it's gorgeous. And then I have the wellness section. So these are really just for like daily inspiration, um, daily reflection. So in here we have a daily gratitude, which I've been loving and, and filling out. Um, then you go into, after that, there is the mindful reflection. So I've started those, I'm still working on them. It kind of like, this little notebook for me is just kind of where I write down scratch notes if I'm on a phone call, if I run into a quick meeting, but I also want it to be inspirational and inspire me and just give me some kind of reflection. I do have a wellness section in my personal and in my A5, but this I just wanted to keep it simple. And here are some trackers, which I haven't yet started, but I'm definitely going to be starting those soon and then some old notes that I kind of just put in the back when I'm done with them and then here I have this cloth and paper pin that just holds together the stickers that I love to use in my weekly admin a planner card the rhythm it's in that tennis um decor that they've been going with on cloth and paper and really guys that's it for my CP Petite in our recent sub box, we got these nice little tabbed um, insert kind of things that you put on your your pages, which I really love because there isn't any dividers yet for CP Petite. I think it's coming soon for the new year. And that's really it. I have a bunch of different kinds of note papers, but super simple, just something I carry around with me. I work in a school, so sometimes I need to take notes on my kids. And this is kind of what I use to jot down some notes or if we're in a meeting. And that is pretty much it. So this is my CP Petite. I love this size. It is so cute. 
I think I am going to make an order for bigger rings. I think this is the 0.75 and I think I can go up to the 1.25 if I'm not mistaken, but I will be getting bigger rings. As much as I love it, I just feel like it's a bit tight sometimes when I'm turning the pages. So that is it, guys. I hope you enjoyed that. Let me know if you are or if you have a CP petite and if you're loving it and what you use it for, I'd love to know. But yeah, this is just my quick flip on my CP petite. And this is in the um, heirloom in the color Leon. So this is my CP petite, guys. Thanks so much for watching. Have a good one.